Well, over the past two years, Bloomington streets have been washed with blue lights at night. Now, some of you asked why are once white LED street lights turning blue? Callie Lichter has the answer. The blue lights are not due to the city trying out a new energy saving light or to make it easier to see the road lines in the dark. The answer is simpler than that, a manufacturing defect. The standard illumination color for an LED street light is a bright white light, but because of the manufacturing defect, one of the many color layers necessary to make the white light is missing. The most common way the blue light, which is the natural color of LEDs, is exposing itself is through flaking and peeling of the phosphor layer. It's very common in the manufacturing of street lights and they buy in huge quantities. So that's why it's taking so long to trap all them down. The problem in Bloomington has been identified as an issue with a subcontractor who works for Duke Energy, which leases the streetlights to the city. The city pays for the equipment costs, installation, energy usage, and maintenance cost of the over 3,000 Duke Energy lights in Bloomington. But Duke oversees the maintenance. Smith said it can be difficult for maintenance crews to determine the light color because they typically do their work during the day. If they can't determine that it is a blue light, it's hard for them, they, don't, they can't replace it. The street lights function the same whether they're blue or white, and there aren't any harmful environmental impacts. I have not seen any evidence that a blue light harms the driving. It's just not as bright. The city is asking residents for help finding the blue lights. Smith said the Department of Public Works and Duke Energy do not know when a light goes out and they rely on community reports. It's just really essential that people help us out. If you help us out, then we can get the light replaced. For Indiana News Desk, I'm Callie Lichter. There are many ways to report a blue street light <clears throat> in Bloomington. You can go to the city's website and follow you report. And Duke Energy also has a light repair page.